This video, uh, it's going to cover, I have a new template out there. This new template really is the Rave Cave, and it's got the lighting for the Rave Cave. Uh, and I put the DMX lighting in it. This template is, is supposed to be uh, used if you're going to use DMX lighting in your in your uh, build. And we may do something else about it after we talk. But the uh, it is the Rave Cave. And it's a standalone, like like the the regular template is that you can go walk your little uh, UE4 mannequin around and do stuff. So, if I click play, it will launch it, and I will take a sec, and it launches, and here we are. We're in the rave cave. The uh, and you could you could walk around, go outside, and see everything. So I, I just really brought the whole rave cave over. We'll probably make this a little bit smaller as time goes on. You can move the character around. What it's for though is for people to build sequences for light shows. And here's what I'm talking about here. If uh, I click on it and I say I click the number one, that that brings the menu up for the things with the light show. And you can do things like manually control the light show. And we'll, I've got videos up there on this previously, but. You could, for example, first of all, you start by maybe turning down the house lights. You know, the, this controls the lighting in the rave cave, so I turn it down. Maybe give it a little ambiance color. Who knows? Or not. Or make it white. The, the, so that, that's one of them. And you can go ahead and you could play with... There's only one universe, but I, I have the potential to add more. And you can do the... Clip, that turned on the... You know, the... Um, Moving headlights, and I could you know change air color, and you could rotate on, so on. So, um, but the the primary, and you can do it for all the different uh, lasers, uh, um, all the different lights that we have in here. So, it give you a chance to play with it uh, and test it out uh, without having to get into the actual game itself. And I really did it so that, so you could go ahead and, and do uh, this type of thing. This is a light show. And I just clicked light show. And what it's doing is playing a sequence. And it's, it turned this light on. And, you know, it, you'll see it change lights. and it, You've seen the light show before. I mean, so it's really using a sequencer. And so I built this piece of software right here. So you could write your own light show. So you could learn to get into sequencer and start using it for things. Um, so... Uh, uh, let's see, and it's, it's kind of not a very good sequence, but the point being is it's automated light show. Let me show you where that is. That, that's down in here. Uh, I've got examples of that. Uh, the, um, this is the light show one. And if, if I look at that, this is a sequencer, and this is getting, and this is how you control animations or a whole bunch of things inside of the uh, side of. Uh, the game and I've got each one of the light types and you can control their position their colors and so on uh, and this is a timeline so this is like doing an animation so that, that's what this is for I'll get it out there and we'll be doing more uh, videos on it uh, it would be something that we would ship with the game so people could build their own uh, build their own sequencers inside of Unreal Engine if they wanted to and certainly we'll use it amongst ourselves to uh, build the uh, light shows. I know a, a number of you would probably enjoy doing that. All right. Thanks.